Welcome back to another Trucker Tim video. Today, I've got something special for you guys. We're going out for a ride in a one of one bull nose truck. I just want to get the driver some merchandise. You like sweets, Dave? We need to sort Dave out because he has lined us up with some content. Depends there for you, Dave. So as I was saying, this is a one of one bull nose truck. It's not a Scania. I know you're thinking it's probably a bull nose Scania, but it's not. So the funny thing is, I'm actually jumping in at the roundabout where I used to stand as a kid and watch all the trucks go round, longing for the day I could be a truck driver myself. And I bet this truck is not what you're expecting. So I've just dumped the Ranger in the green welly calf. This is the roundabout I used to stand on. It feels weird being back here actually. And it should be coming from down that way. DK detailing! <laughs> he's just off to wash the truck right now. State of that. Oh, I think he's coming. Look at this. This isn't what you're expecting, guys. We're going for a ride in this bad boy. Oh, yeah. It's an Iveco bull nose. <laughs> Look at this. What? Dave. How's it going? Oh, wow. Look at this. Now, I bet people weren't expecting this, Dave. No, only one in Europe. The only one? Uh, 150 uh, tonnes? Uh, rated at 150 tonnes. Look at the big nose! As you'll find out in a minute, because it's a very rough ride when you're empty. Better have a belt on if not we get belt. I'll put mine on. Well, this is very different, this is. Yeah, yeah. Stood out a mile when you was coming down yeah, towards me. Yeah, you do get some loops. Oh, look out. Hello. You made Brian is the that... trucker. Yeah, me! <laughs> you are you are on YouTube with Truck and Tim Say hello to the viewers, Brian. Hello viewers, this is number one. Number one. <laughs> <laughs> Give you a ring back later, Brian. Is that right? Take it easy, boy. Yeah, see that, Jack. So this don't come out much, you were saying. Um, he it. doesn't like it coming out in the winter. Right. With salt on it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, got oh, another nice. one. Yeah. But it's not a ball nose. It's the new flat front. I think I will paint yeah. it up. Yeah. I used to drive that skip lorry. Oh, did it? Yeah, yeah GM64. Yeah. Roll and roll off. Yeah. The old back, because he's on spring, so you've got no spring. Yeah, it's just a bit. Oh, yeah, once you get a load on, you're all right. Thank you so much for this. No, that's right. So you sent me an email actually last night and said, I'm coming your way. Would you like a ride in a bull nose IV? I was like, yes. Not a Scania. Only one in Europe. It's the only one in Europe plated at 150 tonnes. Plated at 150 tonnes. I, I have seen some others around. Yeah, but I, not... there's an eight wheeler in Chelmsford. Yeah. Guinness in Ireland, in Dublin, have a four wheel unit one. I talked to the bloke who built this in Germany. Yeah. And he sent me a message the other week saying that sometime this year, he can't say who it is, but right. there is a tag axle bull nose going to Doncaster. So he said he will film me in when uh, further time. Keep our eyes out yeah, for that, I guys. Ooh, still got all the original manuals, yeah, look. Yeah, so it was converted, was it? 58,000 kilometers. Is that all it's done? done? Yeah, so what is it we're collecting? An Etna. It's a what? machine that goes along when they put an, the stone chippings on the road. Oh, an Etna. Yeah, an Etna. Oh. It's about 12 and a half foot wide. To the fuel depot. Towards down a MKT. Take the next right. Oh, I'll tell you can. what, she gets some looks, doesn't she? Yeah, she does. She gets some looks. People don't expect to see that big old bonnet. We've been told the paintwork was over thirty thousand pounds. <gasps> Feel privileged. Well, I'm privileged to be with Trump. Yeah, and Tim, yeah. I've got you a nice selection of merch. Oh, yeah. okay. <laughs> that must take getting some used to with that. Uh, yeah. Look, cool. To be fair, yeah. sitting when here, it looked like you was going to wipe that van out. The, the, the governor said, just drive it. Just drive get it in it and drive and it. Drive I'll it. be worried and to don't death. Don't worry about the nose and you'll be right. If you just spent a few weeks in it, you do get yeah. used to it. Um, yeah, look, look at this. Look, I got you oh a big old selection box. Oh, Have a look at that in a bit. We never rush. If you rush, things go wrong. Yes, it. That is correct, Dave. As I've learned in the long run. Ooh. You're braver than me in this. Send it. Prepare to arrive at destination on the left after 900. Destination meters. is on the right. Do you think it's that one there that's all lit up? Yeah, flashing. It's, flashing, yeah. it's quite big, Dave. That. Back, yeah, no, nah, that's tiny. Is it? That's tiny compared to what we move. Try and get me on something real big. We, you missed it. No, just before oh, Christmas, we missed uh, it. 90 ton elevator up the Euro auctions. All this lot got to be moved down to where we are. There's my mate Louis. This is not too bad. They open right up. Right. To the whole width of that road. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't look very happy, does Louis? Yeah, 
Uh, probably won't like you two. No, I told him you're here, so. Oh. Here we oh, go. Truck a tip, let's go and get loaded. Let's have a look here then. Look at this. What a machine. Oh, what a legend Dave is. Look at that, guys. That is so different. STGO cap free. Twin drive hub reduction, 150 ton. Got a Ford van on the back. Dave will talk us through the airbrushing in a minute. Your tow work for your caravan? Yeah, no, that's for the speedboat. That's for the speedboat, is it? Yeah. It's a king trailer. Yeah, we usually have new Riggers on. The front wheels are really narrow. Yeah. The back wheels are really wide. It's a big old neck though, isn't it? You can't get much up there, can you? Very tall. Abnormal load. Yeah, it is. I like the airbrushed wheel trims. She's on. That was quick. Right, I'm gonna make truck a Tim do some yeah. work. Well, I better do some. Come work. on, Tim. I'll show you all of my experience now, Dave. I've never done this. Been, how long have you been doing this? Uh, two days. No, 20, 24 years. 24 years. Oh, okay. And hook it on. I'm still learning, Dave. You know. Well, you've got to start somewhere, mate. We all started somewhere. He's getting it. No, no, we don't have a look on that one. We don't have a look. We've got all odds chains here, mate. Variety of every chain you want. Whips. Whips the lot. About there somewhere? Yeah, about there, mate. Yeah, you go where you like, mate. See? Well, it's flat land up here, isn't it? Yeah. Carrot crunches. <laughs> well, are you going to have enough? That is the question. Well, she's on. going, she's going. Yeah, I don't know. That's still a bit. That's a bit wobbly dobbly, isn't it? You're crying out loud! It's all right, lads. It's his first day. We've we got a lot on today, have we, Dave? No, I've not got a lot on today. <laughs> got a lot on today, Lou? Yeah, yeah. Louis's got a lot on today. <laughs> Sorry, I've messed it the up. Other, the other driver ain't walled them up, look. Sorry, Dave. Yeah. We've got to start somewhere. How about you get me set up? Yeah, I'll get you set up. Just watch your head. We need a hard hat oh, like. Oh, right, you should. Oh, right, you should. Oh, right, you, oh. you should have enough now, Tim. Hard hat on, yes, he has. He knows. Won't be the first, ain't the last. There we go. Check it out. Right now. That's it. Now the ramps. Ramps. Day. Day. Oh, why is that one stopped? It will. It ain't got enough power in the motor to bring both up. There we have it. Better that way, won't it? Do that for you, Dave. Good old Look boy. Yeah. Good old boy. I had a puncher last night. Oh, did you? Yeah. That's it. Ready for the road again? Ready for the that road. Quick load That's up, that was. That's get the... a very efficient load up, that was. Let's have a little sit in here and see what it looks like from the driver's seat. Ah, welcome to the Iveco Bullnose. And this is the view. Obviously, that's not normally there because that is the Trucker Tim merchandise box. And there is the bonnet. Dave's gone to get some water for his kettle. Sean would absolutely love this truck. As you all know, I'm a proper Scania man. I honestly, I don't like Ivecos. I just don't like them. But this one, this one I like. Here comes Dave with his kettle. We've been going over 50 years now. Yeah. So he had it done in memory of his dad. Yeah. There. His dad in the middle there. I like, I like the story behind yeah, this. The pheasant, that was on his uh, dad's Range Rover. That was so on his Range Rover. He put, put it on there. That. that is smart. And that's Steve, the dad's son. Yeah. And that's Lee, the, uh, the, the Steve's son who runs the company. Oh, he runs now. it now, yeah? Well, they sort of run it together. These are the old tippers we have. Speak, that, that is my old tipper. I Has drive, he still yeah. got it? No, no, no. 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 Oh, you used to drive that actual one? Yeah, yeah. This was the turbo star we had. I drove that. Yeah. That's one of the diggers we had. Has he always had Ivecos, has he? Yeah, always yeah. had Ivecos. That's his dad's Range Rover. Can't get over the wheelbase. Look. Yeah, so long. <laughs> That's the Ford Transit he had. Yeah. 
on the back and zippers. Has he got any of them now in the no, museum or anything? Got, no. Got, they've got some with, that, with them wrenches on. Yeah. The crush that we used to have. Yeah. The screen. That was, we still got that yeah. in the museum and that Morris Minor we've got in the museum in the yard. Did I say Strator? Strator, yeah. Strator, that's what, what is that? Is Iveco Strator. Iveco Strator, yeah. that's what Strator. she is, is it? See you, Louis. Up past 12. Louis just subscribed, Dave. Has he? Yeah, he's a subscriber old, now. Mate. The Phil Dave leave now. He was just saying something about the truck was in the Guinness Book of Records. We'll ask him about that in a minute. Here she comes. Dave! Dave, Dave, Dave wait. Is that the right way? I'm filming again. myself again. Oh, I didn't think you were going to wait for me then. I was going to leave you here, mate. On to be 1093. Got to remember what way we come in. Yeah, I know my way back. Ibico's asked Steve if they could use this in the Guinness Book of Records. Yeah. To be towed by an electric van. It's the first ever okay. Ibico electric van to tow 150 tonne. Yeah. So we had a 75 tonne excavator on the back. Yeah. Uh, a lorry tied behind it and something else tied behind it. And yeah. The van pulled it. Really? Yeah. Straight on, drive. Straight, straight on. We'll go through well. <laughs> yeah, no, we don't want to go through there. Not too bad. It only weighs 12 tonnes. Is that all it weighs? All that 12 tonnes. Weighs 12 tonnes. But 16 when they're loaded. I'm about to show you so, what you've yeah, got in your box. Got well, in your selection box, I want to see you wearing these. Trucker Tim socks, a pink Trucker Tim sticker for any female followers you may know. I may know a few, yes. Yes. And then lots of stickers, lots of air fresheners. I'll get you one up in a minute. Uh, more stickers. Oh. This makes good content. We have to put in some dramatic music now, Dave. Yeah. Could slide off the road. He could slide off the road. And we have to get Lombardos out. We've got a tractor behind. It's all going on. It's not got a very good turning circle. Is it not? The very stretched wheelbase. Oh, Here's drive. You're very calm under pressure there, Dave. Well, I used to, uh, to be fair, <laughs> to be honest with you, I'm very, very short tempered. Are you? Come on. Come on, what are you doing? I've learned over the years that the world out there is full of sausages. The world is full of sausages. You see when it comes to car drive. <laughs> I just got out the truck of Tim's socks and it all kicked off. <laughs> yeah, got a coaster here for your beer. Oh, lovely. Really sorted you out here. Some sweets. Oh, he's happy with that. Yeah, a bit of suck on, suck on them on the way down the M11. Key rings. Pen. I want to leave that in here. That's got to stay in here. That's... There we go, drive. I've got your t-shirt in here. Good man, I want a t-shirt. I've got you two. I've oh, got yeah. your large and extra large. I didn't know what size you'd be. Well, it's extra small, I reckon. Extra small? Three feet. Oh, I'm waiting. Oh. Alright then, Dave, if you insist. Quite oh, a train train here, Jesus. It's always taught by the boss in the cab fit to try and follow him. Well, yeah, it will. That's what I'm told. After 300 meters, turn right onto B1093. Put you an air freshener up yeah, in here. Put me an air freshener up, Jimmy, mate. Give Brian the trucker one. The old air freshener freeze. Do you like that air yeah, freshener I do smell? Like that air freshener. There's one for your car there as well. Oh, Give one to Brian Works, and. Breathe in. A lot of people know me as Dangerous Dave. Oh. As, as you can see by the t-shirt. Ah, yeah, Dangerous. Yeah. You didn't tell me that. Quite well known in the low low community. Are you? <laughs> For all the wrong reasons. Yeah, probably. We won't go into that. No, we won't. Could be. <laughs> Where's this park at night times? In a, it's got its own little bedroom. Its own bedroom? Yeah, heated bedroom. Goes in a room, keeps it all dry. You've got to wash it when you get back tonight. Wash it when I get back tonight. Yeah, 
actually yeah. pulls well, Dave. Yeah, when, when it's got 70 ton on it, it's still, still pulling. Yeah, what was yeah, it, 570, yeah. you say? Yeah, yeah, but the boss had something to do with the gearbox ratio. It's got a 16 speed box in it. Yeah. Where all the other automatics only have 12. The only downer with it is it's got such a small fuel tank on it. Why has it got a small fuel tank when uh, you've got such a long wheelbase? I don't know. <laughs> no one you knows. got all that space. No one knows you chuck an uh, IV up on the neck. You yeah, chuck yeah. a fuel bowser on the neck. Okay. Yeah. Like Perfect. Uh, yeah. What, are you going to fill up in the lay by then? Yeah, well, when we get to the job, we fill up. <laughs> fill up in the job. Like that, yeah. This is my stop. This is your stop, Tim. Thank you very much, Dave, nice for this. <laughs> Cheers, Dave. I'll, I'll Keep you know, in touch. You've got my number. I'll send you a photo of your socks tonight. Yeah, send me a photo of your socks. I will. Enjoy Thank you that. Very much, Tim. We're not bothered about people behind no, Dave. Look, he's just cleaning up. <laughs> Thanks, Dave. Really appreciate that. Thank you. Here he goes. Oh my word. Oh, I think we'll leave him to it. Oh, you want a selfie? Do you want to be on the video? I thought you were coming out here just then to uh, tell me off for parking in the calf. So, what's your son's name? Kyron. Kyron. Shout out to Kyron. Right, let's go to the unit and catch up with DK detailing. It's so easy. Hello. You've been here an hour and there's nothing it happened. because of traffic. The state of that. So you want to start work now that I'm here? We've had to have a little social. Yeah, yeah this God. Is she offloads onto me. She <laughs> <laughs> I hope you don't. <laughs> Breakfast. Dan was just telling me how he offloads on you. <laughs> that was very nice, that. Yeah, no roll. worries. Yeah. yeah Look like after it. you, don't we? Like Kenna Tech again. Yeah, yeah. See we'll obviously, you know, using my products, that'll obviously then reflect in the bill. And then we've got breakfast as well. So this one should be quite cheap. Last week was quite cheap. It was, it was free. Don't tell everyone. No, no everyone, okay, it wasn't every, free. Everyone will want it. Oh. Oh. Truck's looking clean, thank you. Welcome. What I was wanting to do, move this chassis where this red one is and put the red one where this one is. Got me steering wheel on, look. Lovely. Push away and I'll steer. Right. Is that gonna hit the cab? Right. We all right? Plenty of room. Drive Plenty of room. room. <laughs> yes, the four series is moving. Straighten her up a little bit. This is the furthest it's been in like ages. Things you get roped into, Dan. So Dan is moving the truck. What we're gonna do, we're gonna put this here and this here. So strip down and we can finish off prepping this here. And then when it's time for this to go to Darren's, which hopefully, fingers crossed, won't be long, it'll be ready just to go straight out and we haven't got to mess around moving stuff around. Yeah, she's good. The full series chassis is outside. It's not been outside for ages. We'll give this a little sweep and then we'll put this here. Only the light. No. It's alright, it's alright, it's alright, right. don't worry, don't worry. So that right there was probably the last time this truck will move. Bit of a sad, sad day really. Yeah. God knows, got something else. What have you ordered now? Four series chassis can come back in here. It's nearly ready for paint. So close. Door, yeah? yeah, straight in, out the back into the dike. New position. Dan's now going to put the truck back in. Woo! Yes! Stuff is happening. Did you enjoy that? I want to drive it. You just did. Yeah, I'll, I'll, yeah, but I want to drive it for, for, for a living. Time. I ain't got any yeah. work for it, so oh. we have had a shuffle. 
series is now in front of the four series that will be. Things are moving, mate. Things, things are moving. moving. Things have moved. Some things have moved for the last time. I'm looking at JCBs. Do you want to send in a JCB? You want to buy a JCB? Yeah, for lifting. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Now we've had a big change around. Let's have a little look from up here. Ooh, look at this. Ah, oh, it's good to have a change. Good to have a shuffle around. Refresh. Red 4 Series here, the 4 Series build there, and the R Series there. Yeah! 